next for you? I know that River Road is your latest effort. Yes, River Road is my latest Jane Ann Krentz book of romantic suspense. And the next book out will be an Amanda Quick book, which will be another historical, um, set in the Victorian era. And it involves a woman who was a world traveler. Women of the time, they called them globe-trotting ladies. <laughs> and they wrote journals and they wrote books and how to travel the world wearing 40 pounds of clothing. It wasn't easy being a world traveler in those days as a female. Oh, yeah. Trunks. you got to carry oh, trunks. trunks and tons of clothes. And you <laughs> wouldn't want to be seen dead in a pair of pants, which is <laughs> the only logical thing to actually wear. And so she gets into a scrape with a serial killer back the one place she thinks she's safe, back in London. And then the hero is a spy for the crown. And the two of them solve that crime together. And that's called Otherwise Engaged. And that's out in April. River Road, Otherwise Engaged. Yep. And you're going to keep on writing romantic suspense for us? Yep, regardless of the background, the landscape, whatever. I just love romantic suspense. Yeah, because your heart is pounding in two different ways. That's a good way to put it. That's an excellent way to put it. I'm going to steal that line. Oh, please do. <laughs> Tell me about your readers. I think the reason my readers connect with me is because they probably share a lot of the same core values. It's almost impossible for an author to keep his or her core values out of a book. It's not something you consciously put in. It's just going to be there under the surface of every line you write. And I think we attract readers who are also attracted to the same core values because they share them or they want to share them. And I've always felt that if you like my books, it's probably because we have a lot in common when it comes to values. And if we ever met, we'd probably be friends. I'm just now meeting you, and I already have that comfort of feeling like I know you. And it's probably because we share a lot of the same values. I think it just goes with the territory, yeah. Yeah, well, no wonder your readers love you. They oh. do. They love you. I love them. Oh. <laughs> you keep reading, I'll keep writing. Deal. <laughs> it's a deal. Thank you. Come visit us at KindleLoveStories.com or at our Kindle Love Stories page on Facebook. <laughs>